Yeah. I said I ain't messing with her unless she real, real fine. <laughs> you feel me? I ain't messing with her unless she real, real fine. Oh, Lincoln just went to the first day of show. So make sure you're your How was it, Lincoln? Your Take your thumb out. Uh -huh. You want me to ask okay. you now? I'm going to use it as I bust. You want to look at her? She's been watching it all day. You went to daycare today? Okay, okay, okay. okay. How was daycare, Lincoln? Lincoln's first day of play look good. Cantaloupe, green beans, flatbread, and some type of cheese. Seven hours later, I'm done recording. Be sure to check out this video if you all missed it. I'll have it linked in the description box down below with all of the other videos that I randomly mentioned throughout this vlog. Give me good lighting. There we go. There we go. Let's get some helium. Where the hole did I put in here? Can't find it. Make another one. Hey y'all, it's all Destiny, and in this video, we'll be opening up my birthday gifts for my 28th birthday because it's been about a month and I have not it's been about a month and I have not opened them yet. So if you want to see what I got for my birthday and a lot of the gifts are from you guys, then keep on watching. So that is pretty much it for this video. Questions and comments, be sure to leave all that down below. If you want to see more videos like this, then continue to send me more gifts to my P.O. Box. Duh. Bye. Wait. Bye. Wait, that's not, that's not high enough. I'm recording. I'm recording. <laughs> Why would she be doing that with helium? Duh, didn't you know it's because she can do whatever she wants? I know, but I'm saying she's running out of helium. Hold on. But I'm saying we out of helium. Goodbye. Can y'all hear that? Do you hear that? Let me let my hair down. That is the sound of us getting our yard done. Kim. Sometimes me and Dominique will do it, but it's been raining. It got out of hand. And my dad was gonna do it tomorrow for us. But I heard the people outside doing the people's yard across the street. So me being me, I was like, let me go over here, ask this man for his card, ask him for a quote, bada bing, bada boom. Yard cut is getting edged. The Bushes and the hedges are getting all nice and manicured, if you will. Other than that, I'm getting ready to film a Dollar Tree pedicure tutorial because I'm going to a rooftop party tonight, my first rooftop party. I got X to go, so I said yeah, and that's where I'm going. I think I may soak my nails off and just do some press on nails, actually. Oh, you know what I could do? I could do the Dollar Tree pedicure, no, I'll do it separately. I could do the Dollar Tree pedicure and the Wild Greens press on nails tutorial together. That way I can kind of prolong, like I'll get my nails done, but not necessarily have to dedicate two hours to acrylics for the time being, because I don't really feel like it. I think I'm gonna do that today. And I took out $100. Before moving, I used to challenge myself, regardless of how much money I had, y'all should do this too, or pick a different number, it's up to you really. But I feel like 100 is kind of reasonable you know so I'm starting back to do that versus just taking your card and just swiping it because you can't really keep track that way me being me sometimes I may not look at it every single day my parents tell me that I should especially because companies could possibly charge you double or more or whatever the case may be so with today being Thursday I won't be going back to the bank until next Thursday and I'll only be living out of I mean minus bills and stuff obviously y'all get what I'm saying but as far as once that includes like going somewhere if I get fast food all of that has to be included and then if I don't make it to Thursday unless it's like a direct emergency I just don't get to get anything else so I'm challenging myself to that maybe I'll make a little video on it living out of a hundred dollars for a week or something like that I don't know let me know if that would be a cool little idea do you all have a budget like that let me know if you all kind of like get out cash or you kind of just swipe strictly off of your car for things that you may want or need and as far as my dress I gotta take that back they left the sensor on there luckily me being me I hold on to my receipts for a while, so I still have the receipt. But I got the email. JCPenney actually emails you receipts. I'll just show them that 
but obviously they know I didn't sneak anything out of JCPenney. Let's be honest, at the mall, come on now. Y'all see my $6 pan where you get them, they range from about Okay, girl, you better ride that bird to this event. I'm in the awkward vlogger. Yeah, I've been to uh, Peabody brunch before. Thank you. I came for brunch for my 27th birthday. Everyone to exit to the left. Oh, you gotta go Good little click baby. Click baby baby. Oh, you got sure to him be like, look who popped up in my house. Look who popped up in my house. <laughs> this side think like a YouTuber, y'all. Let me show y'all what the side came and pulled up on your girl in. Ooh. Ooh. Let us see. Ooh. Ooh. Some 
light, some light. I don't know. Okay, the side. A little some. A little some, you know. Show me a trunk. She came over to get candy. All right. Hold on, hold on. All right. Cell phone. Okay. Listen, listen. <laughs> oh man, this is the only way I can feel. I'll be right off in the sunset. <laughs> no. The way I'm holding the camera, they can't see nothing but you. Cause oh, I'm okay. a pro, I do this. I forgot. I decide. I'm gonna film you pulling off. I'll edit this part out so I can send it to the group later. Ooh. Okay guys, we need to do my hair really quick. I've been rushing all morning. I tied my hair up last night, but I really didn't get to like touch it up, touch it up the way I wanted to. I hate to take this down. My eye exam is at 10.30. Since I had something else to do before my eye exam this morning, didn't really have time to do my hair just yet. So I grabbed a few things that I would need. I also just swung by McDonald's. So I'm going to do my hair first. That way I can let my edges kind of sit. I may or may not put this top knot back up. I brought my bun maker, but I put a lot of product in my hair, so it may not be able to hold. Now, let me lock the doors. Creeps. Creeps, man. Creeps. I got a little bit of water in here. Uh, I thought I was going to make it to the gym this morning, so I got my gym bag with me. Judge me if you want. I'm going to use this water on my hair to kind of help me brush it around a bit. I slide back, I can get this mirror. Back. Goal here is to just put your head in the frame, your hair, not your face. Cause we don't need to see our face. We just trying to get our hair together. I don't think he know he called me. Hello? Don't you able to call you and they don't know they called you? Like, do you stay on the phone in case something bad is happening or do you hang up right away? Come in, let me know how long you wait. Got some oil. One of my subscribers sent me this. This is Miracle Elixir by O'Shayla's formula. If you watched me unbox my birthday stuff. All of my birthday gifts. That's where this is from. I'm doing my hair in the car. What are you doing? I have an eye exam at 10.30. My hair is so dirty, Oh, Time to go to an eye exam with dirty hair. I don't know why I didn't wash my hair. I be procrastinating. I'm a procrastinator. When you work for yourself, it can make you be a go-getter or you can have your lazy days. If you like, I don't gotta do this today, I can technically do it tomorrow. Life of a YouTuber, man, or any entrepreneur. Anybody that's working for themselves will know what I mean, maybe. All right. The easier option would be not to try to twist my top knot back, but to put just brush it out and put this bun on it. Because for the top knot hairstyle, I need my hair to be more like weighed down and laid down to twist it into the braiding hair. But for the bun, my hair was perfectly blow dried at Paul Mitchell when I went, but I don't know now if my hair is gonna be enough to cover it because it's so weighed down. It was more fluffy, I guess, when it was in the um, blow dry state. But as long as I brush enough of this, to, yep, I can do it perfect. perfect. Perfect, yep. Oh, if I had a rubber band. But since I don't, I'm just gonna keep brushing and brushing. And then just rub to make sure that you don't feel the little wiry feel of the bun maker that lets you know the bun maker is being seen. So since I don't feel it, I'm just gonna begin to wrap now. I did my brows at McDonald's. <laughs> I grabbed my brow pencil, my LA Girl Pro Conceal and Toffee because I can use that one on top and bottom if I have to, this little brush to clean it up with. And you know, everybody wants breakfast at McDonald's, which meant I had plenty, plenty of time, honey, plenty of time to do my brows. By the time I got to the window, I had placed my order and everything. Brows were done. I said, boom. Now I'm just going to open up my travel size even New York edge tamer that I keep in my purse. This is a small one you can keep in your purse or if you never tried it out and you want to but you don't want to pay full price for the larger one, get the small one first and see if your hair likes it. I like to lay my edges before, like in the process of doing the hairstyle and when you finish up. This is not supposed to be a tutorial. And the back where I drop it at. Eesh, I dropped it. Oh, it's in the cup holder, thank goodness. Get ready with me in the car. How to slay in the car in five minutes. Well, I could edit this to five minutes. It, it matters what you keep in your purse, honey. We're gonna take this next and begin to do our edges. I have so many of these things. I keep one in my film room, one in my restroom, one in my purse, one in the bottom of the cabinet in the film room, one in the drawer in the film room. <laughs> like, these are everywhere. Let's do a little hook, why not? And I'll do the other side off camera since you can't see it anyway. And then we'll be eating next. Life of a girl, we do this. We do this! And you get compliments and nobody has the slightest idea unless they watch me on YouTube hi that I did all of this in the car oh I like your hair it's so cute oh thank you 
<laughs> well, it took me five minutes in the car mirror to do it. When I post Instagram pictures, y'all be like, that's me, her always lay, you always look so cute, blah, blah, blah. Girl, I probably did my hair in the car before we took pictures. I'm excited about my eye exam, though. I'm messing up the bun now. That's why I like to do the edges first. You wrap and tuck, and you don't need a hairpin. Bang, bada, boom. This lets me know that my hair is growing. This is my largest bun maker. I got the fat bun in. Yup. Yuppity, yup, yup. Make sure it's laid. Let's put the hair scarf on while we eat. It's 9.53. Got my big purse today. If I was wearing like a little fanny pack or something, I would not have had all of this on me. Brows done now. I didn't bother with mascara or no makeup makeup look because, you know, they put the traps in your eyes. You gotta lean in and get all close. Your lashes, if you blink, they just, it'll be just doing so much. I got McDonald's here, trying to eat healthy, but sometimes I'm lenient with, lenient with my breakfast just because you have all day to work it off. Don't have that kind of mindset. Don't be like me, folks. But yeah, I got hot cakes with sausage. Only thing now, I gotta not be a klutz and waste syrup on myself. And I got a hash brown. I got an orange juice this morning at the gas station. So, we're about to eat. Oh. We'd be like removing these sicknesses, germs, diseases from this food and let it be nourishment and strength to the body. Meanwhile, yes, I like a plate full of all fat, all grease, chillings, and all the unhealthy stuff and let it be nourishment and strength to the body. Amen. <laughs> What? God is like, quit playing with me. What you want me to do? Look at what you eat. It. Nourishment and strength where? <laughs> Now it's 10 06. I'm gonna go ahead and go in because I need to use the restroom. Hair is looking good. Who did their hair in the car? Who did their brows in the car? Got on my Fenty. My Fenty. <laughs> Get my glasses. I brought my contacts because sometimes, like, if you have your glasses, she'll you'll do part of the tea. Y'all know how eye exams go. Just in case. Really, I think my contacts are giving me problems because they're oh, you know, you have to swap them out often. So that left one be giving me problems. And as far as the glasses, I link the video. I have to go through my videos and find the one when I came to let the eye doctor last time. I mean, I got these. People be so loud on speaker, so disrespectful. And I'm recording. <laughs> Y'all have been seeing me and my contacts and my glasses a lot not on Instagram clearly because when I take a picture you take them off I forgot I gotta use the restroom now that I'm distracted from it I should start walking now so that I can make it bring in my OJ because it'll be hot by the time I get back to it. Now, like on my birthday, for whatever reason, thank the Lord, I was able to wear my contacts no problem all night. My eye wasn't bothering me. It wasn't running. And I had lashes on. I had to keep doing like that. Like, I had none of that. And I've had a few other times like that. But most instances, if I put my contacts in, in about 20 minutes, the left one has to come out. So, I mentioned that to her. But I also mentioned the fact that I'm out of contacts. So, I wasn't able to throw that one out and just get another one. Well, luckily we're having the eye exam today. So I get to get new glasses and new contacts. Let's go. I might not make it. I hope it's on the second floor. Or oh, we just gotta find the restroom. Oh dear. Okay, let's see. I think it's, yes, there it is. Oh, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. Oh, my phone is in my back pocket. made it. I made it to the restroom. Thank goodness. This top is from Burlington because I know y'all gonna ask. The jeans are boohoo. Even though y'all can't see the whole thing. Lotion. It's only like 10 13 so still making good timing. I gotta film my press on nails tutorial for y'all. If the video is out by now the card is on one of those sides. <laughs> Don't click on it yet. You can click on it when the video when this one goes off. It'll be at the top of the description box too. If y'all want to get some $11 press on nails, girl. Fake acrylic nails, whatever y'all like to call it. And I already put it here, 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 here. And just like a dab on my on my ear. Or behind it. Now we're ready for my appointment. I'm just really killing time, guys. You don't have to do all of this before an appointment. Since I had to do something else before this, I didn't want to go. I was thinking of ways to kill time, basically. Anywho, enough of the explanation. We don't do those. Look at these brows, though. Like, this is what I like. <laughs> Guys, 
So my appointment is over. Let me tell y'all the time so y'all know how quick it was. My appointment was at 10.30 and it's 10.48, which means in and out. And I have my contacts right here. Clearly, these are the um, trial ones, so I have to come back for them. Thanks, hi. I have to come back to like pick up my actual ones. I didn't pick out new glasses because my prescription didn't change. So she said that it was really no rush and these were fine, which they are. So I didn't get new ones, but I think maybe eventually I'll probably just come back in just to get some black frames. But for now we're good and I got new contacts. As far as, oh, excuse me, as far as medical reasons or anything like that, we're in the clear. So it was nothing like that, just mostly the contact being old, I guess. We're all good. She tests me for, you know, when they put the drops in to test you for glaucoma and everything. We're all healthy. Thank goodness. Everything is good. Let's go start the day. There we go. What do I do with the keys, Kim? When I have been complaining about my contacts, I don't know, sometimes I guess I probably, depending on the way things are said, a lot of y'all are like, oh my God, go get that checked. Hopefully for everyone that was concerned, also I do appreciate y'all being concerned about my well-being, but hopefully this little update will be good enough for everyone to hear and to see that's why I wanted to record it and take you all with me. Well, not actually record the exam. When I'm doing something that's more of like a professional setting I never like to really be in the way with my camera or even probably ask like oh could I record my exam like <laughs> who does that youtubers do that of course we do but I figured I would at least just kind of as far as update you all on what was said let you all know but the exam goes pretty quick um you just kind of read with the left eye read with the light I mean with the right and then she'll take the glasses off I read again we do the glaucoma check she puts the little drops in and then, and then your eyes kind of feel heavy I think it's the carrot parameter I forget what it's called and then she does that as well basically an eye exam so and then just personal conversation and she was asking me how my YouTube because she knows that I do YouTube and all of that so she probably wouldn't have minded I was just more so concerned with getting my exam done than trying to prop my camera up. plus y'all wouldn't have been able to see anything because the lights usually kind of low and stuff life of a youtuber what shall we do now life of a youtuber i don't have anything else to do today hmm i mean i could edit a video but i really don't feel like it hmm i'll check in with y'all when i'm doing something i don't want to just sit here and go hmm the whole time and y'all like she not taking us anywhere get in the back seat put your seatbelt on buckle up take a nap if you like and i'll wake you up when we get somewhere else interesting <laughs> People think the worst. That's why I had to update y'all. I'm on the phone currently. That's why I was just telling my friend that I wanted to take y'all with me so that y'all would know there's nothing wrong with my eyes. I hate riding in this lane where the trolley is. It just throw the car around. He wants to zoom past me and not let me over. That's fine, sir. That's totally fine, sir. But yeah, I had to let y'all know. I think when people tell y'all stuff on YouTube, sometimes people think the absolute worst life or death, what they say. You should go get that checked out because I had a cousin like that and she, my contact lens was just, oh, baby girl, and my camera. Okay, I'm on the E-way now and my camera blinking fine. Hey, this song, that's just how you live. Money and pretty women. 